Out of hospital cardiac arrest is a massive healthcare problem. Every year in the US alone, over 350,000 people die from cardiac arrest. Then the problem is that they do not have access to the technology that can save their life. And that's an automated external defibrillator or an AED for short. 911, what is your emergency? Uh, it's, it's my wife. I've been shaking her, but she's not moving. I, I, I don't okay, think hold she's on. breathing. She's not awake? She's not responding. And she's not breathing at all? No, she isn't breathing. My what do I do? I'm dispatching an ambulance to you, and I'm going to work on getting an AED to your location. Please, please, just hurry. Okay, I'm going to help you out, and I'm going to give you some instructions for CPR, okay? We've mapped out where people suffer sudden cardiac arrest. Our goal is to distribute these connected automated external defibrillators to be close to the places people most often suffer sudden cardiac arrests so that the AEDs can get to their side within those critical four minutes to save their lives. We're very excited about the Four Minute City program because we see it as an extension of what we're already doing with providing protocol-based instructions on sudden cardiac arrest events. To be able to continually increase the technology available continues to pay dividends to the public and those that need it when they need it most. We're really, really excited that there are so many people in the community that are willing to take these AEDs and respond to emergencies because if we place them appropriately and make sure that there's an AED within neighborhoods and close to people that are experiencing sudden cardiac arrest, uh, we have a much better chance of impacting uh, life-saving activities. I I'm just so excited to be a part of this Four Minute City program because it is a legacy that we are able to extend to people who may have previously died because no one acted and there wasn't an AED around to act. Making the device accessible is a key tenant of ours and we do that with our revolutionary AED, the Avive Connect AED. In addition to that, now we've got to make sure that that accessible device that is more pervasive now in a community actually gets to that emergency as fast as we can possibly get it there. And that's where we built our overall connected platform to help address that solution. We've integrated that device into the overall public safety ecosystem and communities to help 911 telecommunicators actually get that device to patients quicker, but also then get the right data from the device to all of the right stakeholders in the public safety community so that they can better respond to that emergency. Making sure 911 knows exactly what's happening on scene. Making sure EMS has better access to the data from the cardiac arrest. And the same for the physician downstream at the hospital who's gonna end up taking care of that patient as well. Trying to connect all of those key players through this system of response that we've built so that we can have better outcomes ultimately. The Four Minute City Project has the potential to save more lives than I will have saved in my entire career and life's work as an emergency responder.